what's up youtube and i'm finally back making video so today um i will going to show you how to install microsoft visual studio on your computer so just head back in the description below i have a link there so here's the actual site that you're going to be downloading it so it has many features like i don't have to read this one you can read this and it have it has like a uh, seven gig of file setup size and um in order to install microsoft visual studio you you can you can like have a minimum uh, ram which is one gig and uh it will take you like 20 gig of free space in your hard drive so the processor is gonna be like a, uh, i don't know but it must be like 1.66 uh, gigahertz of processor so what you're going to be doing is to download all the the file of course and you're gonna you will bring you another tab and just wait for a second for this to uh, prepare your the file and you're kind of like have to click this uh, button right here click here to proceed and you will be in this steps it, it is like three steps and just wait for that and here's the final stage as you can see so as you can see guys um i have already down uh downloaded it right now I'm, i mean i down i'm downloading so we can go to the uh downloads in our chrome you can press ctrl j on your keyboard to show it as you can see it is like seven gigabytes which is actually huge and uh it, it will take a time it, it will depend on how fast is your internet so i will just going to cancel this one since i already have the file so I have the file in my backup folder and as you can see I have the, the Visual Studio Professional 2015 and I will just go into double click or just right click and mount in order to mount a virtual uh, disk drive and I will try to go to this PC oh sorry and as you can see I have a DVD drive it is not an actually it is not a real drive but it is just a virtual DVD drive so as you can see I have I have already down in here so I will what I will going to do is to uh, just click the this application VS professional this is the installer and you're gonna have to double click that one It will take actually time guys so just wait for that and finally it is now uh, initializing so in just a few minutes we will going to start the install so it will take you to this kind of option so choose your location I will just choose the default one which is actually in my program files times 86 so uh, it will ask you to choose the type of installation you can customize the installation or you can just do the default and install it so just click install and it will just go into install and click yes and it will ask you do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device now you have to click yes So finally guys um, the f the wait is over so it's done and it will actually take time depending how fast is your internet you will use 
your internet it downloads some files on it so in here it's it is saying setup completed however not all features installed correctly so the installer failed another version of this product is already installed so i have already this uh file so doesn't have to uh, you know do that again so you can open visual studio by just opening back you um going in the start menu going down into visual studio just 2015 or you can just you know um visual studio type it on your you know start start menu and then you're gonna have this visual studio thing you can open that one to check if i will just open this one so i must reboot the system first before i before i can open it so i will just going to reboot it right now i'm going to pause the video so okay i'm going to pause this hey guys after restarting your computer you can now open your visual studio so um here's the blend for visual studio 2015 and um you can open the actual by going to the v uh, category so i have the visual studio right there and i will just going to double click or click that one and it will just open it up it will actually take time again to open for the first time and uh, yeah you can just wait for that so it will ask you to sign in to your microsoft account now if you have microsoft account you can sign in or maybe not maybe let maybe later so i will just do it later you can choose the uh, settings of the um, Visual Studio environment. You can have a dark. Uh, I mean, you can have uh, JavaScript, Visual Basic, C Sharp, or you can have all of them. So um, I will just going to choose the theme. I will going to choose dark. I, I love dark you know so start visual studio right now this will going to take a few, few, few minutes and you can also change the theme um, again when you're uh, in the visual studio if you don't like the dark one you can have the blue one or you can have the normal white thing and so as you can see you have now the visual studio professional 2015 on your computer so you can create a project there let's try to create a new one and you can choose Android and you can as you can see build native app for Android you can have Windows you can choose any kind of this Windows form application WPF application which actually stands for um, Windows Presentation Form. So we can have like the UWP, Universal Windows uh, App, which is not in here. And you can see, as you can see, you. Um, no, it's not in here. Why? Or maybe I, I I will just find it later. So you can also create a file on, I mean game like Unity, Epic Launcher. You can connect it in your Visual Studio. So that's it guys and I hope you have learned uh, I mean you have you have installed uh, something I mean you have installed the the Visual Studio on your computer so thanks for watching and if you didn't subscribe yet you can subscribe to my channel and uh, yeah that's it 
thanks for watching and hopefully see you on my next video.